Namaste, Karyom. Today we will see 30th verse of second chapter. And in this verse, last time, Bhagavan would like to convey Arjuna and to share with Arjuna the fact of our self as a consciousness. So Bhagavan has said in this verse, Dehi Nityam Avadhyoyam Dehi Sarvasya Bharat Tasmat Sarvani Bhutani Natvam Shochiku Marhasi So again Bhagavan has addressed Arjuna as a Bharata. So oh, lineage in Bharata kingdom, Bharata Kula Vanshaja, I am, de, I am Dehi. The meaning of Dehi is the indweller. The one who is sitting inside the body is called Dehi, meaning the Deha, the body is different and one who is sitting inside the body is different. Like we are residing in the, our house. A house is called Deha. So house is different and we are indwelling in this the house when we are different. Same way the body is like a house. When we are sitting inside the body is called Dehi. So Bhagavan says I am Dehi. This indweller who is residing in this body is Nityam. For the, all the time Nityam Avadhyah nobody can kill him indestructible so this dehi in veller is avadya and for whom he says sarvasya for each and every body one who reside inside the body is nityam avadya nobody can kill it nityam avadya and that's why bhagwan says if nobody can kill dehi Tasmat means for that reason. Tasmat Sarvani Bhutani. For all beings who are who has this Thula Sharira, one who has this gross body, for all beings, Dehi is always indestructible. And for that reason, Arjuna Tom Shochitum Na Arhasi. For that reason. O oh, Arjuna, you need not to grieve because it is a common nobody will kill who is residing in the body. Only this gross body will go. Nothing else will go. So in short, Bhagwan would like to convey the Chaitanya Tattva, the consciousness is called Dehi which is or ever Nityam Avadya. So Drona's body has consciousness, Bhishma's body has consciousness. This one who is inside the dwelling inside the body, that consciousness, Nityam Avadya. For that purpose, you should not grieve for Bhishma and Drona. So, this is the last time Bhagwan has conveyed Arjuna at consciousness level, you need not to grieve. Now Bhagwan will say in next work, he will come down and he says, having seen your responsibility, you should not grieve. That we will see tomorrow. Hari Om. Namaste.